Well, if you're thinking about walking and biking, a workshop tonight in Brainerd aimed to get the community more involved with making the city more pedestrian and bicycle friendly. As our Scott Sheehan tells us, the program allowed the community to voice their concerns and brainstorm how to fix any problems. Making Brainerd and Crow Wing County more bikeable and walkable. This evening a workshop was held in Brainerd to get members of the community more involved in making the area more walkable and bikeable. The purpose of the workshop is to take a look at all of the different aspects um, that make walking easy in a community. We operate with the 5E model, um, so it's a comprehensive approach to incorporating physical activity into daily routines. The workshop targeted local engineers, law enforcement, planners, and other local officials to discuss what the area needs to improve on. It brings together individuals and, that are interested in walkability and bikeability in our community and gets everybody on the same page about what the issues are that we need to address. During the workshop, community members got a chance to voice their concerns as well as working groups to develop new ideas to improve walk and bikeability. I think my biggest concern is about safety. Walking is a healthy way to commute, a way to play, a way to get places. But if it's not safe, people are not going to do it. And I see a lot of places in Brainerd that are just not safe to walk. The lack of clear signage, lack of uh, clear bike trails. We have uh, signs up that say bike route, but really there's no corresponding bike trail. Uh, just a lack of uh, safety in general in terms of the planning. Brainerd's Walkable Bikeable Committee plans to use the information gathered at this workshop to develop new strategies to improve Brainerd's walk and bikeability. Scott Sheehan, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.